All right, today you have Esther. So Q benchmark time. This is one of those ones. It is 15 minutes of no breathing. There's no rest today. There's no nothing. So get your mind right before you come into the gym because you got a doozy. How it works. You guys have five three minute rounds. That's your 15 minutes. In three minutes, your goal is to complete 200 meter run, five kettlebell cleans, and then 10 kettlebell swings, all right? Goal is for that to take you about 90 seconds to two minutes to knock out these three movements. Then the remaining time of that three minutes, your goal is to rack up as many double unders as you can until the next bell. Ding, 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 bell goes off, round number two. You're right back out the door again. Again, there's no rest, there's no transition. Once you hear that bell, start it on that second round. And then your goal is to accumulate as many double unders as you can for your score on the workout today. All right, so your score is how many double unders you got across all five rounds, add it up together. All right, so 200, you guys know, for your kettlebell clean. You guys have two hands on the kettlebell. Butt is down, back is flat, just like a barbell. Drive to the legs. Elbows are going to rotate around to where it creates a shelf. And then you guys are going to land with a nice tight core going all the way down in that squat and then standing up between each and every one. All right? Now you have 10 kettlebell swings. So it should be a heavier weight today. Go ahead and hike it into the hips. You guys are going to go ahead and extend through the hips up overhead, making sure you guys get your elbows locked out every single time. And then your head comes through that window. All right? Now you've got maybe a minute to go. You're going to grab that jump rope. We're going to do as many double unders as you can. So two flicks of the wrist for every one jump. Trying to stay relaxed and make sure you guys can count for this, all right? If you don't have your double unders, just do your single skips, or if you're working on double unders, do as many double unders as you can, just throwing them in every now and then, all right? Have fun with it, guys. We look forward to it.